Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to make this headlight zoom out transition effect easy and quick in After Effects. After my latest reel, some of you asked me to do this tutorial, so hit that like button and let's make it easy. Scroll forward from where you want zooming out to start and move your headlight clip right there. We should mask the headlight now, for an accurate mask and tracking I will use Mocha AE. In Mocha grab a pen tool and mask the headlight as smooth as possible. Once you're satisfied with the mask, enable perspective and hit that tracking forward button. As the tracking is done, click on save button and close Mocha AE. Expand mat now and click on apply mat. Duplicate headlight layer and rename it to car slash zoom. Expand mat again and hit on invert mask. If you now move headlights position you will see that we can open and close it. Let's toggle it off for a while and create new camera. Rename it to zoom and set preset to 35mm. Move camera layer above zoom and headlight layers and then cut it where the headlight layer starts from. Enable 3D on car zoom and headlight layers. Then expand camera zoom layers transform and click on point of interest and position stopwatch icons. Press U on your keyboard to open only created keyframes and then grab a dolly cursor tool and zoom all the way in. Now scroll forward something like this, then right click on both positions and select reset, this will bring everything to normal. Let's quickly check the zooming out effect. Everything looks cool to me. Now enable headlight layer and then scroll to the end of your very bottom clip. Then select headlight and press P on your keyboard to open position. Click on position stopwatch icon, then scroll back something like this and change headlight position down until you don't see it. Let's check it again. Everything looks cool to me. Now select camera zoom layers keyframes and press F9 on your keyboard to easy ease them. Then go to graph editor and make a smooth curve like mine, or play around with the curve until it will look cool to you. Now select headlight layers keyframes and press F9 on your keyboard, then go to graph editor and make a smooth curve. Nice, I'm happy with it. Now make sure to enable motion blur on car zoom and headlight layers. That looks way smoother and cooler. Lastly we can add shake effect, I will skip that part cause I have already made a shake tutorials. Also I have created 16 unique shake presets that you can get from the link in description. Check how it looks like with my shake preset. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.